All right, we've arrived to a coffee shop that's located in a subdivision, which is just across the road from the mangroves that we visited. Da 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 da! And we're here. This is nice. This is very very tranquil. This is the name. I can't read that. Habuan. Habuan. Okay. And apparently they do really fresh, authentic coffee, Filipino coffee, according to Kim's description. Yeah, but. Oh, it's very beautiful. It is. And this is someone's home. Well, even it's not like a home home. Oh, well, it's not a home anymore, is it? Yeah, of course not. So it's a full-fledged business in this uh, subdivision. Wait, oh, it's very beautiful. It is. Like well, watch your head. Watch your head. Watch your head. No, watch your head. Yeah, I love how you duck when you don't need to. I, you didn't tell me earlier, so it wasn't clear. The drinks, sorry. Oh, okay. Can we leave it here first? Thank you. What's going on? Every time I go here, they're not here. Wait, what What are you referring to? The one who makes the fiber. Makes the what? Fiber. From the pineapple. And honestly, lost. Pina. It's a Filipino fabric. It's a Filipino fabric. Oh. It's a Oh! This place is really famous, I think. Wow. What are they making? Pina fiber. Pina said the combination is worm and pina. Okay, worm and, and pineapple fiber. Oh, wow. Yeah. Worm and pineapple fiber, yeah? Correct. So this is used to make like gowns. Garments, yeah. Yeah, skirt. Yeah, it's crazy that they use it from like they take it from worms, right? Yeah. Look how thin it is. I know. It's really fine. This one over here. Um, this one is the one that we the Oh, so this is what makes the design. This is different. This is different. Oh, the pattern is here. Ah, okay, got it. Oh, yeah. Wow. Okay. Mm. One meter equates to one yeah, width of doing this. Yeah, this one. This design is one meter, one meter. And that, that's just this process? Yeah. That doesn't yes. include the process of obviously uh, refining yes. the... What would you this call this? The threads? Um, I would call the threads. Threads? threads. Pinia fiber? Fibers. Ah. Pinia po yung binibig namin. Yeah. Tapos yung strand po nito is silk work. Yeah, they're called fibers. Fibers, yeah. Fibers. That one is with worm. Yes. Ito, pinia siya dal. This is the pure pinia. But this is more expensive, right? Because it's pure pinia. Oh, really? The pineapple is yes, more expensive yes. than the worms? Because wow. it's harder to, to get. So these six pictures hanged on the wall explains the process of how the fibers are prepared. Yeah. Here, the pineapples are yeah. harvested. Harvested. Uh, then they're... Extracted. The then they're extracted. extracted. Uh -huh. and it's going to wash and it's going to... Um, Hang it. Okay, so dry. they're washed and dried. And then? Then we're going to tie it. But before we're going to knot, we need to separate every fibers. Okay. So, so you knot, 
you knot the fibers together to make long strands, right? And then you use this machine to, which is it? Uh huh. So that they could put there in the work. So the threads are extracted from there, from that pile of <laughs> dust. Sand. Sand. The, the only reason why they have the sand is so the fibers don't fly away in the wind because they're almost lighter than air. Yeah. And they're put into this wheel where I still don't understand the process why they're put into She's this. Counting it until oh. 2600. There. She's talking. Okay, so this is a counting machine where they count a fine amount of threads. How do you count it then? How, how can you count it? Is there a mechanism? Ah, oh, I see. So they're counting the threads until they're like 2,600 precisely. And then they transfer it over to this machine. And then from that machine, what do they do? They knot it so that they could give. Okay, and this is where they knot it. This one is Pinya. Pineapple. This oh, pineapple is pinya and this was pinya seda. Pinya seda. Seda is worm? Um, silk. Oh, silk. silk. Yeah, that's what silk is. The pineapple is a lot more brittle because the threads are thinner. thinner. The pinya seda is stronger, easier to weave, right? Because they're less brittle. This is kind of like a museum, isn't it? The pineapple leaves is they have a two kinds of lower and upper. Ah, uh, this is more shiny and white. Mm -hmm. This is used for the like that one. Okay. Trail garden. And then this one we used to we pure weaving. Yeah. Okay. Weaving. Right. Uh -huh. And then after that, and then you do the thing. Like this one. Oh, so you split. You split. One Each fiber. Yes. You split it and then you put it here? Yes. I think this one no. Okay, this is more of the pinia. Yeah. Uh, pinia. And then you put it here? <laughs> yes. We and not nothing. Goodness. It's so thin, you can't even see the thread. Correct. And what she'll do is uh, she'll push down one of these bamboos, almost like it's like one of those piano kind of pedals. Yeah. And then that will lift it up. And then the other one will subsequently lift it down. So these are always crisscrossing. This is actually a very famous attraction of Kaliba. Uh -huh. I've seen it like on the tourism material, like you can visit this well, cafe. Started, I think, oh really? Wow, I don't think this was the place that you were going to show me. Because I was wondering where this was. Oh, okay. You saw it in Google? Yeah, I, I kind of wanted to visit it. Yep. And then um, it's here, yeah. Nice. Let's go get my coffee. I know. All right, we've just got a coffee from Habugan and we witnessed some pineapple and silk threading from this cafe. I didn't realize it was all integrated into one. But folks, I'm going to wrap up today's video here. A big thank you to Kim for showing us around her hometown and showing us these fascinating places. I don't think Kalibo would have been as great if she, if it wasn't for her showing thank us around you. her hometown. So folks, subscribe to the channel, like today's video and share it with friends and family, and I'll see you in the next video here on the channel. Many thanks for watching guys. Take care and bye for now. <laughs> Back into the whip.